I think sometimes as bartenders, you kind of get like lumped up into this whole, what am I doing with my life? Like, I'm gonna do this forever. Am I gonna try something else? So starting my own bartending business has definitely been great motivation to keep going with bartending and within the industry. Um, but it's also kind of made me into a brat because now I don't like anybody telling me what to do. My name's Molly and I will be making a Cadillac margarita today. So I was bartending in restaurants for about 10 years and then I left during COVID to start my own event bartending business and I've been doing that for about three years now. Instead of people coming to the bar and kind of being grumpy, everybody's happy that I showed up. <laughs> yeah. This one, I encourage everybody, like there are other options out there for you if you are tired of just being at a restaurant or at a bar and you wanna venture out and try something new, like there's always new and different things that you can, you can try and just go for it, you know? So I really love tequila, it's my favorite spirit. Um, I've actually been to Tequila Mexico and gotten to go on some of the really cool tequila distilleries. And it's just really cool to see them harvesting the agave, growing the agave, uh, pressing it, cooking it, and making it. So I, it's my favorite spirit by far. Everybody thinks there are so many rules with drinks and there really aren't rules. Um, if you like something, drink it. So today I'm making a Cadillac margarita. Um, and a lot of people are confused by what Cadillac means. While you can use a higher end tequila, it mainly means that you're gonna be using Grand Marnier in the cocktail. I love classic cocktails. I think they're classic for a reason. And while I do love the transition of some fancy cocktails that are out now, and I love fancy drinks, I love to stick to the basics. And that's something else that I recommend. So some people say they don't like certain alcohols or liquors, and I always say you just haven't had the right cocktail. So I just always re recommend going with the bartender's opinion if they're experienced and skilled and they know flavors well, they'll be able to make you a really good cocktail. Mm -hmm.